Hey, what is going on guys? So today I'm going to be showing you the best uh, NVIDIA 3D settings for Fortnite uh, for performance and FPS increase. So first off, what you want to do is right click on your desktop and go to NVIDIA control panel. And by the way, this only this is only for people who have an NVIDIA graphics card. Um, so yeah, for those of you who are AMD or Intel or whatever, you're probably just going to have to find a different video. Anyways, you want to, you want to go to adjust image settings with preview and check use the advanced 3D image settings and then click take me there. And then once you're here, you want to go to program settings and select Fortnite as the program you want to customize. If it's not here, just click add and then find it from this list. And if it's also not in this list, you can click browse and then just select the exe. Um, but yeah, once you're in here, you just want to copy these settings. So anastrophic filtering off, anti-aliasing off, gamma correction off, anti-aliasing mode application controlled, uh, transparency off, CUDA, uh, use these GPUs and then select your GPU or multiple. If you have multiple GPUs, select them all, uh, maximum pre-render frames, put this on one for the least amount of input lag, multi-frame sampled AA, turn this off. OpenGL rendering GPU, select your main GPU, uh, power management mode, prefer maximum performance, uh, refresh rate, this is only if you have like a 144 hertz or anything above 60 hertz, you want to choose highest available. Shader cache, this depends on whether or not you have uh, your operating system is installed on a solid state drive or a hard drive. So if your OS is installed on an SSD, then you want to turn this on. If it's installed on a hard drive, you want to turn this off. Uh, texture filtering, this one, turn this off. Put this on allow uh, quality, high performance. Trilinear optimization, turn this off. Threaded optimization, turn this on. Triple buffering, turn this off. Vertical sync, definitely turn this off. Uh, and then this doesn't really matter, but I just leave it on one. And that's basically it. After you're done doing all of that, just click apply and you should be good to go. Uh, once you launch Fortnite, these are the settings that will be applied and you should see a increase in FPS as well as performance and less input lag. So that's basically the video guys. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.